Let's see, get that next step, Jimmy, just to show what it's doing. So I just wanted to show you that. It's definitely worth doing. show you the pond the weeds at the pond as far as mowing the and working in the garden it's just too wet um, no way we can mow today I I didn't know I thought the rain was gone and, and this isn't really rain it's just a really heavy drizzle but it's got everything very wet so like it's not making the ground any more muddy it's just making the grass and everything else all wet so we're gonna wait on the garden we did some already got the those two plants that you bought um, we fed those and mulched around those and weeded around those and a couple of the roses I pruned all the roses a couple of weeks ago I sprayed them all to get rid of that black spot mold stuff so but as soon as the sun comes out, but it not, might not be till Wednesday before it'll be dry enough to mow. And just as we're going through here, I mean, this stuff is just, this took off this weekend just with this little bit of sun we got. It was dry, but it wasn't real sunny. So it's, and then the, of course the garden is just, again, out of control this I mean this this is the one spot that we're doing okay that this grass did well enough to keep the weeds out I mean there's a few in there that we could pick and it wouldn't be that big a deal because like I say the grass is really doing well there but as far as the rest of it you'll probably see it tomorrow but I just wanted to show you show you now to give you a little pre-info where you meet Luis but like on this side see that that's all weeds that's not there's not much of the grass that they planted in here so it's just the same you can see how wet I got just walking that little bit so we can't uh, that's why we can't work in the garden. Can't mow in there anyway. So yeah, you can see all the weeds in here. The irises, they they keep the weeds at bay, which is nice. Those were all here before. But this stuff is just, just out of control and it's different waves. We, we pull the tall ones and these little ones coming in are gonna get you know, reach maturity, then we pull those, then another one's right behind it, and... At least that you'll see, but that, that's one they planted, and those are ones they planted, but the rest of this is just weeds. So anyway... See how muddy it still is in here. I mean, this is just from before. I mean, we haven't got any rain. Um, I say a drizzle today, a couple hundredths. Uh, nothing this weekend. Nothing last last week. Uh, last week we got some, but not not since like Wednesday or something. Anyway, that's that. Um, there's mouse tra I'm leaving the mouse traps in the house. They've been in there since last Monday when we changed them and checked them last Monday when Maria was here. And 
There's no mice. We've caught no mice for a week, um, which is good. But I think I'll go ahead and leave them. I know you guys are just coming up to meet Louise, so um, usually I'll clear them out when you're coming up to stay. Because there's we got like 13 of them in there. So no mice right now. Um, that's all I wanted to show you. I got the, the electrician's coming anytime, and he's gonna pull the outlets out of the barbecue out of the countertop, the barbecue, uh, to get ready for that that change and to fix those outlets. I don't think there's anything else I want to tell you right now, but just wanted to show you the weeds here because Matt, you asked about it, and tell you that the garden's going to have to wait a few days to dry out a little bit.